guys, back on that corn unloading sheds. Now, I'm going to spray the base a dark yellow. And I've also, with where my tracks are going, I've just covered it with. I've just covered the tracks so I don't get paint on it, so when I put the rails in. And the little office, well, I'm just putting it there. So I don't have to scrape the paint around. So I'll, I'll paint this the same colour, but it will be a different colour. It's like an undercoat. So I'll spray the whole lot. We'll see what she looks like. So that's what she looks like sprayed. Okay guys, now I'm gonna prime the, or undercoat the little shed. It's gonna be a grey primer. Or a flat grey primer. So that's what she's going to look like in grey, but that's only the undercoat. So that's what she looks like all finished guys with the primer. Now all I'm going to do is the big shed. Alright guys, now I'm going to do the big shed. Back in the same primer grey. But the whole shed's going to be all the one colour when I do the new colour onto it. So the roof and the walls will all be the same. Guys, now that shed's all finished. Next will be the top coat, and I'll show you that when I do it. Okay, guys, back on the top coat now. I'm using Rust Oleum spray. Now this colour is ivory silk, so hopefully she'll look good. And the roof and everything's going to be all the same colour. Same with the little office and it'll be the same colour as well.
so that's what she's going to look like guys so I'll just finish it then I'll okay guys right. back on the finish of the corn unloading and storage sheds that small picture on the box is what it looks like on the box and I'll show you what it looks like all finished and that's the finished product guys the track that's in there now is just sitting there and I've just got to glue it so I'll wait until it's on the layout so I know how long to make it so that's what ivory silk looks like so I'll call this a wrap for this build I've just got to weather it up but I'll weather it up when it's on the layout and as you can see the little office inside it's the same colour as the outside I didn't go with the doors I decided not to but that's the end of this build. Thanks for watching guys.